All right, here we are. First game of the winter futsal season, 2020, 2021. It's the 09 Pivo versus the 08 Pivo. The 08 Pivo team is completely changed from last year. None of the same boys are there. A lot of the boys left the program. And uh, 08 Pivo also does not have any subs tonight. On the other hand, the 09 Pivo has two full teams here. We have five on the court and five on the bench. Starting on the court, we have Luke up top with Julian, Voorhees, and Mac in the back. And then we have Ethan DeLay in goal. Starting with a high press. Looks like we have Coach Kevin coaching for the 09 boys, and I think I saw Coach John over there for the 08s. Not sure where he is right now. Boys starting fast. Big scoop. Oh, what a save. He saved Luke's shot with his foot. Athletic effort. Luke lays it off for Voorhees. Couldn't find the target. Well, Max in, Max in, can he get a shot off? Adam shuts him down. Julian with a shot. Good shot to the keeper, and they go fast. The keeper's gonna dribble. Oh, it's a mistake. Just wide. We seem to be keeping the ball in the opponent's half, which is good. We're about three and a half minutes into the game at this point. Looks like there's about to be some subs. Subs getting ready to come on. 20 minutes left in the first half. Oh, missed the corner kick. Oh my heavens. Play till the whistle, play till the whistle, boys. They knew immediately it was an infraction. Now they've given up a free kick at the top of the arc. Good shot, good block. It was a handball. The ref said he thought it was a handball because uh, our keeper's not wearing a different color jersey. Of course, we're not allowed to use pennies with coronavirus. Free kick for white. Now, as we can see, 
Mark and Brady and Tripp and Liam are on the court for White. And Blue is really playing without a coach because I see Coach John over on the other court. So no coach, no subs. Oh, but they're finding their way through. Look at that. I thought that was going to be a goal. Preston with a shot. Good block by Haven. Haven's in the goal for us now. Oh, that's a foul. Tripp's going to play it back to Haven. Haven's going to have a blast. Scoop right to Brady. Brady over to Liam. Liam turns, and does he get a shot off? Blocked. Brady drives, dishes it out to Mark, cuts it across. Excellent ball across the face of goal. Trip almost finished that. The keeper happened to be in the right spot. Haven will recycle it. We're really keeping them pinned in. I expect we should score any minute now. We are just giving them unrelenting pressure here. Oh, great one, too. Brady finds a way through, but the keeper was there. And they can't even throw the ball out of their own half. Look at this. Several rule changes this year. You notice that uh, on goal clearances, the uh, ball does not have to be thrown out of the area before it can be played. Also a change on kick-ins. It doesn't, doesn't matter anymore if boys step onto the court. On kickoffs, it doesn't matter if you kick the ball forward or backwards. So several, several changes. running forward. Haven to Liam. Liam shot. Oh, and the substitutions are starting here. Luke in goal. We're down to the 16 minute mark, so the boys are obviously rotating every four minutes here. And we're going to get a free kick in our own half here, and we're going to make some substitutions. Original five boys all on the court now. Excellent pressing. Oh, and before he's, I mean, uh, Ethan Delay creates an opportunity there with his good pressing. Uh-oh, Blue is in. But we managed to do enough to put him off. Blue is in, blue is in, blue is in. That's going to be a penalty kick, I think. And even a yellow card. Look at this. We'll have to watch that one back on video to see whether that warranted a yellow card. But he was in on goal, was in the area. There was contact. And the worst keeper in the league is in goal. It's Luke Ribeiro. I'm allowed to say that because he's my son. But I've never seen him play in goal and not concede. Adam Heller is taking the kick. And he misses wide to the left. Luke didn't even move. He had it covered. He had it covered. We'll say that he knew where the, key, the kicker was going. 
Oh, look at that. He played it over to me. Not mag by Ethan Delay. Oh, and the blue guy there held him back, held Delay back. So it's definitely going to be a free kick for White now. Mac and Julian both wanting to take it. It's going to be Julian. Oh, and he's going to tap it to Mac. He's going to go back to Julian. Are we going to get a shot off? Yes, right to the keeper. Oh, hang on to that keeper. Hang on to that ball. Corner kick blue here. Corner kick blue. Be a white kick in. Subs. Brady going in the goal for us. And all the other boys rotating off as well. Keeper dribbles, he finds Preston. Can Preston get the shot off? No, he's shut down by Liam. Oh my heavens, how is that a foul? They're gonna give Blue a free kick just outside the arc here. The good news is Luke is not our keeper anymore. Trip with the defensive header. Blast from distance. Trickles into the net. Toe poked in at the last second there by Preston. Not a lot the keeper could do about that one. So finally it's 1-0 after half the first half has been played. We still have 11 minutes to go. Kind of a surprising score with all the pressure we've been putting on them. I thought we would be leading by now, but we find ourselves a goal down. Every last one of our boys is pressing very hard. Very good play by 09 Pivo for first game of the season, that is. None of them forgot to how to play over the break. Oh, wow, that was excellent reaction uh, touch there by, by Liam. He almost redirected the ball into the net, which would have been fantastic. Mark intercepts it, he turns it to Haven. Haven is in, oh, he's shut down. Brady dribbles. Trip covering for him in goal. Haven fighting for that ball over there. Oh, he's going to get a foul for that. That's just good physical play, ref. Come on. Oh, that's excellent by Haven. Excellent awareness. He saw the keeper out and he capitalized on it. We're all tied up at 1-1 with nine minutes and change to play in the first half. Long distance uh, shot. I'm not sure Brady was aware of it, but it was well over the crossbar. Whistle. 
we're going to get a free kick for that. I'm not quite sure why, but I guess the ref spotted a foul in there. And that's going to count. So Liam's first effort was blocked, but Tripp was on the doorstep to knock it home. Kick blue. Blast from distance. Mark. Just wide. Oh, wow. Great shot from distance. Liam, it had to be saved with the goalkeeper's toe. It was on frame. Corner kick, Liam drops it to Brady. Brady plays it to the back post, but it's wide. Mack coming in the goal. Oh my heavens, Blue makes a mistake in the back. The keeper tried to stop it with his foot and missed it altogether, or the defender did. In any case, it resulted in a corner for White. Luke with a dummy Mac shot from distance. We had some substitutions here. And so we've got the original five boys back on the court. Blue trying to find a way through here. It's a great pass by Ethan Delay. And couldn't quite find a way through. We continue the high press. Blue is in on goal, but Mac did a good job there and blocked the shot. Luke Ribeiro, what a shot. Three to one with six minutes to go. Scoop. Good interchange, Luke loses the ball. Max, left shoe is untied. I hope he doesn't trip him up. Oh. Intercepted, can he hang on to it? Press, 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 press. Press, press, press. Pressing there by White. We're continuing the high press. Every once in a while, Blue plays, plays the ball over the top to get out of their half, but most of the game so far, we've been in our half, in their half. And we also are covering back very well. 
So even when they do get possession in our half, we manage to close it down pretty quickly. There's gonna be a shot. Can he get a shot? He did get a shot. Mac was there. Subs coming on. We're at the four minute mark. And so we're gonna finish out the half with the second group of five boys. Accidental Meg there. Brady with a blast. Oh, slippery fingers with the go from the goalkeeper there, but he didn't go into the net. It's gonna result in a white corner kick, however. Let's see if we can get a shot up. Excellent, played right across the face of goal to Haven's foot. Oh, a couple players down there. No whistle? Oh, now we're gonna have one. I think he was just checking to make sure they're okay and he's gonna do a drop kick or a drop ball. I'm not sure why he wouldn't allow Liam to play that if it was a drop ball. A little bit confused on that one. He's gonna drop it again. Scoops it in, there's only one blue shirt and four white shirts. Liam plays the long ball. Good idea, because their keeper was out of the area. And good pressing by Liam. Almost forces a bad mistake in the, at the back. Handball by Trip. I don't think the ref saw it. Went out of bounds anyways. A good one-two there by Blue, but they uh, are having trouble getting the final shot. We are just pressing all over the court, and I think we are the stronger team. Shot from distance was a good idea, but the keeper managed to grab it. Oh, look at this. We have Mark Ranieri playing in goal now for us. So almost every boy has had a chance in goal. I think by the end of the game, every boy will have a chance in goal. Oh, that's a great ball through by Tripp to Liam. And did they keep it in? I think it's gonna count. What did the ref say? It is a goal. Well, I don't know. The ref is deliberating. He's talking to Coach Kevin. He's gonna give us the goal. Four to one now with less than a minute to play. Mark goes quickly. Liam is in. He's going to score another one. Look at this. Oh, just an inch to the left of the left-hand post. Brady's going to blast it. Oh, across the face. But Haven couldn't get a toe on it. Haven. Brady. He drives and he hits the post. Wow. And then Haven with a follow up effort. Down the court to Blue. Four one at halftime. <laughs> 